a happy and a pretty amazing reunion that's been over a decade in the making. So the story that we're about to share stretches from Houston to Fort Worth. Brooke Katz with the details, all new at 6. That is him. Wow. Hey, buddy. Reunion. I love it. I'm crying. You guys are awesome. Oh, wow. Missing for more than 13 years, Aaron Webster and his family were reunited this month with Remington, who they call Remy. And shortly after, we talked on the phone and realized it was Remy, and it all kind of, you know, started going from there. The little guy was picked up by Fort Worth Animal Control, who called in the organization Saving Hope. A microchip linked Remy to the Websters in Houston. First of all, he just said, "How's his health?" He said, "Does is he is he okay?" Um, and he didn't look good. He was in bad condition, but his health was fine. The five-pound Yorkshire Terrier mix had a wound on his face, hair loss, and no teeth. But it didn't matter to the Websters or Mackenzie, who helped bring a family back together with their pet. Incredible. That's really the only word that comes to mind. It was warm fuzzies. You were, I mean, we cried, definitely. All of us shed a tear, at least just of joy. The joy that can be seen on the faces of the family and little Remington, who's finally home at last. So everyone can really only speculate what happened to Remy over that decade. No one really knows how he made it from Houston here to Fort Worth. But this reunion would not have happened if this little guy wasn't microchipped. So it's a good lesson for all of us how important it is to microchip your pet. Yeah, and on the on the past thing, looks like he was taken care of. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Well, to a degree. Uh, to a degree, but he was in pretty rough shape when they found him. Oh, when they initially got him. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Well, he's home now. How crazy is that? 14 years. 14 Thanks, Brooke. 14 years. That's crazy.